Good morning. I'm here with my friend Neela. We're in front of Disney Disneyland's big hotel. And Neela's from Germany. So Neela, where are you from in Germany? I'm from Berlin. I'm a tech recruiter and career coach for software engineers. I'm here at the conference with my fr friend Jeanette. And we are having an awesome time. It's a great adventure to see all the celebrities and uh, billionaires here. I know. So yeah. there's a lot of black carrying American Express card people here. I'll tell you that much. All right. So we've like really been learning a lot, but the best thing that we've been learning is like making new friends. So doesn't she? Isn't her glasses gorgeous? Thank you. Yeah, really, <laughs> really gorgeous. So today we spoke to you, Hilton, and we learned, and it was so interesting. Like. Basically, don't you feel like his five characteristics of what you need to be successful is to, is to make the right choices, yeah. to be creative, to be curious, to be compassionate. Whoa, there's a car yeah, going crazy here. So what I want to talk about right now is how do you keep your curiosity up? How do you keep your curiosity up? I mean, it's, it's important to, you know, to know your why. Exactly. First of all, like I want to, you know, give. Giving back is a really big topic, I think. And, uh, you know, you need to keep going. Um, keep, stay positive. Um, know your why. Give back. Um, and it will be fine. Right. I also think the big thing is making good choices. Yeah, definitely. I think definitely. That it's all about choices. It's right? all about choices. And I feel as though if you don't take any risk and you don't make any choices, yeah. then you just stay stuck. Exactly. But if you make a choice and it turns out not to be the right choice, mm -hmm. and sometimes you think you're making the right choice, but then it isn't the right choice. Yeah. I think the key is the way you look at it after, the way you brush yourself off, pick yourself yeah. up again, and get going again, because otherwise you get stuck in that exactly. feeling. Let's just talk about creativity for a second. How do you stimulate your creativity mm -hmm. when you just feel really tired or you just, like, you can't think of the next idea? Like, what's um, your life like? I, I, I meditate. Um, daily, on a daily basis, which is uh, really helpful. That this helps me to, you know, um, get some new ideas to like recover myself, um, and also, um, you know, go on adventures. It helps. I travel a lot. Um, I meet new people, networking, um, meeting new people, finding out about their their ideas, what they're doing in life, and how they, you know, do it is um, is obviously helpful. Like speaking to people is, you know, gives you amazing ideas right I also think that one of the things is is that I felt like I was like losing my creativity just mm. sitting there so long so I came out to get the sunshine yeah I feel like exactly. being out Ooh, here it's, yeah. it's <laughs> just it's so beautiful the Sun is just so beautiful out here and so we came out to, to talk in the sunshine the best thing about Disney is that it really taps into magic. imagination. You, yeah, <laughs> you really feel that magical yeah. feeling all the time, yeah. every minute. There yeah. are just all these little kids are dressed up with <laughs> crowns, and all the little boys are dressed up as superheroes. So much fun in Disney. And now we're going to go get our cup of coffee, but we didn't want to miss our coffee time. Yeah. So we're going to go get our cup of coffee. Have a really great day, and I'll see you tomorrow. Have a great day, and see you soon. Bye bye. Bye. Oh shoot, I did that wrong.